Ted Seifert, Zaner Ag Hedge, our guest today. Uh, Ted, let's talk about the demand side of things. We've been kind of looking for for some news there to really spark, you know, some something in these markets. We haven't seen anything in a while. What's your take on on where demand sits and, and whether I guess China really ever gets back in this market at some point? Yes, great question, Clint. And I'm less worried about for corn than I am for soybeans because I do feel like our uh, demand for ethanol as far as you know we're going to be driving now political things aside i think that part of it's going to be good feed demand is going to be good at least domestically the question is china right um and the question for me is really soybeans you know because with asf issues over there they've said that they're not going to use as many feed grains for the for the second half of the year second half of the marketing year and so that's got to be a bit concerning compile that with the fact that they have not been aggressive buyers in soybeans here lately so the question is, what's going to get them buying soybeans again? Uh, and I think there's two answers to that. One way is that, you know, we see prices come down and they like prices. You know, maybe it's a dollar, maybe it's a dollar fifty, maybe it's two dollars below where the market is right now. There's a number where they would start to aggressively buy soybeans. At least that's that's my thought. Uh, and at some point, the market might have to go find that number. And and. The longer we go without rallying, the more likely I think that's going to be the scenario. And maybe they're going to buy aggressively at what we would call harvest lows. Okay. The other way that the market can find that demand is if we were to rally based on a market and then they start buying because they say, oh, no, we have to buy now because the prices are going higher or the stocks aren't just are just are not going to be there. So one way or another, we got to find that demand. There's two different scenarios on how we do it. At the moment, I'm a little worried that the market's going to have to see lower prices in order to really excite that demand again. And that goes for our domestic crush as well. Yeah. How long are you willing to give it to, to see some indicators here? A month, two I, months, I, three weeks? You no, know, by the, less than that, by the next 10 days. You know, Once we're into the okay. second week of August, if we're not rallying on weather, I think the market's gonna have to break to find that demand. All right, appreciate it, Ted. Thank you so much for being here. We'll be back with more Ag Day and a check of weather coming up in just a minute. For professional marketing advice specifically tailored to your needs, call Zaner Ag Hedge at 312-277-0113.